I know, Vulcan, he said, having recovered some of his composure. Your beacon won't work. This chamber is teleport shielded. Nothing goes in or out except through that gate behind you. Still trembling with the aftershocks of absorbing the energy shield, Kurz managed to stand. Did you think you had broken me, brother? Did you believe you had tricked me into letting you escape? He grinned. Hope is cruel, isn't it? Yours was false, Vulcan. You're right, I conceded, holding up Dawnbringer so he could see it. I fashioned it as a teleporter, a means to escape even a prison such as this. I counted on you leading me here, on your needing to face me one last time. Seems I was fooled into thinking you hadn't planned for this. I lowered the weapon and let the weight of its head pull the haft down until my hand was wrapped around the very end of the grip. But you're forgetting one thing. Kurz leans in, as if eager to hear my words. He believed that he had me, that I would never escape this trap. He was wrong. What's that, brother? It's also a hammer. The blow caught him across the chin. A savage upswing that took Kurz off his feet and put him on the ground again with the sheer force of the impact. He got to one knee before I hit him again, this time across his left shoulder blade where I split his pauldron in half. I jabbed into his stomach before swinging a second blow that put him on his feet. <laughs> 